Yeah. So y'all finna tow this? Dang. Oh, wait, we gotta get a picture. Wait. Kingstone was still trying to take pictures of the trap car as it was being towed away. He drove all the way from Philadelphia to see it. I'm definitely disappointed. At the end of the day, this is for us. It's for culture. Trap, trap, trap. He says the 12 hour ride was worth it to take a picture in front of the trap house and see the display. It might not seem big to a lot of people, but it's definitely important to us. Atlanta police and local council member Felicia Moore received complaints about the house, specifically the car and washing machine out front. The car was towed away after people jumped on top of it, smashing the windshield. Business owners in the area say it's been a huge headache. It's been very difficult. The amount of people in and out disrespecting us, trash, uh, just the people running across the street is so dangerous. Trapping. And it doesn't show any sign of slowing down. It's everywhere. It's on Twitter, it's on Instagram, it's on Snapchat, it's on TV, it's on radio. <laughs> it's everywhere. Tatiana Court says she understands why neighboring businesses are upset about trash on the ground and increased traffic in the area. But she still wants to see two chains keep it up. I could see them like maybe if he buys another part to build a parking lot for it, if it becomes a public establishment. But if it's just something for now, I think it's okay.